to prepare more for your science olympiad let's solve one more class 2 nso 2022 set b question paper so let's solve it and get ready for your olympiad first section is logical reasoning question 1 select the odd one out let's see all the figures so we can see a b c d they have a clock inside circular clock and all the clocks are showing 9 o'clock so that is same now let's see the outer figure 1 2 3 4 5 so a b and c they have five sides that is pentagon whereas d has six sides that is hexagon so d is odd one out question 2 if this figure is related to eyes that is cube is related to eyes then in the same way cylinder is related to very easy option c can moving to the next one question 3 a for letter is called nail cutter nail cutter is called lipstick and lipstick is called bulb then dash is used to cut nails now first tell me what is used to cut nails it's nail cutter right and what are we calling nail cutter here it's lipstick so option a is the right answer question 4 find the missing number if same rule is followed in all the three figures now let's see the first figure it's 8 12 and 20 it's look it looks like that 8 and 12 are part of 20 so let's add them 8 plus 12 equal to 20 yes that's right Let's use the same pattern over here or same rule over here. 15 plus 11 equal to 26. Wow, it matches. Now we will apply the same rule in the third figure and find the answer. 7 plus 14 equal to it is equal to 21. So the right answer is option B, 21. Question five. Ribbon band dash dash is fourth from the right end. Let's find the right end. It is written over there. And what we have to find? We have to find the fourth ribbon badge. Let's count: first, second, third, fourth. We got fourth as S. So option B, S, is the right answer. Next section is science. Question six: Touch me not plants. Droops its leaves when touched. It shows that living things. can breed can give birth to young ones can grow or can move on their own the leaves of touch me not plant droop down when touch that shows that living things can move on their own because the leaves are moving option d is the right answer question 7 which of the following is a natural non living thing now let's see a so it is not a natural thing the car or the jeep is a man made thing so it's not the right option option b yes mountain is natural and they are also non living thing so we got our answer option b is the right answer let's see the other also c is not valid because it is a living thing and d is also not valid because it is not a natural thing it is man made so only option b is the right answer moving to next question that is question 8 we get gum from the dash tree do you know that gum is obtained from the stem of acacia that is kiko tree option a is the right answer question 9 select the option which correct, correctly shows the relationship between number of seeds in different fruits let's see a mango lychee okay mango is equal to lychee that means the number of seeds found in mango Are equal to the number of seeds in lychee, and do you know how many seeds are there? Only one. So actually, we already got our answer. Our answer is option A because it is showing the correct equation. Mango's number of seed that is one seed is equal to lychee's number of seed that is one seed. Whereas number of seed in watermelon is more than cherry. Papaya has more seeds than peach. and pomegranate has more seeds than pear so only right equation is in option a question 10 select the correct match of animal and the thing we get it get from it sheep honey no that's wrong 
because honey is obtained from honey bee cow silk that is also wrong silk is obtained from silk worm horse eggs that is also wrong because hen gives us eggs right goat milk now this is correct because we get milk from goat option d is the right answer question 11 in the given diagram what would deer be called now here let's see very closely plants are eaten by deer and deer is eaten by lion is deer a prey animal pet animal domestic animal or none of these now here we can clearly see that deer is eaten by lion so prey what is prey prey is an animal that is killed and eaten by another animal that is predator here lion is predator and deer is prey so option a prey animal is the right answer question 12 you will go to the place shown in the given picture when you so this is a picture of hospital and when do we go to hospital when we are either sick ill and have to see a doctor a is the right answer Question thirteen. Select the incorrect option. Now here, one side it is vegetarian food, other side it is non-vegetarian food, and we have to see wherever it is a incorrect option. A cereal, that's correct. That is vegetarian. Chicken, correct. Non-vegetarian. B pulses, correct. Vegetarian. Prawns, correct. Non-vegetarian. C meat. Now meat is under vegetarian food, which is incorrect because it is a non-vegetarian food. whereas chapati is mentioned in non vegetarian food and it is a vegetarian food so option c is the right answer that is incorrect option question 14 which of the following activities is unsafe let's see one by one in option a children are boarding a bus forming a queue so that is safe in option b kids are running on a staircase oh which is an unsafe activity so we already got our answer option b is unsafe activity but let's see c and d also c is a kid a uh, kid is swimming under the supervision of an adult using a swimming tube that's correct d a kid is cycling wearing a helmet that is also absolutely safe activity so option b is the right answer which is unsafe activity question 15 looking at the given picture of a room of a house the good habits to be followed here include so this is bathroom of a house right so let's see flushing toilet after every use it's correct turning off tap after every use correct turning off shower after use correct so all of these are good habits to follow in a washroom so option d is the right answer question 16 what does the given activity show In the figure, we can see that a boy is blowing air into a balloon, and when the boy is blowing the air, the balloon is being properly blown, right? And what is going inside the balloon? It is air. The air fills up the space inside balloon, and because of which balloon becomes bigger in size. So this activity shows that air fills up space. Option A is the right answer. Question seventeen: Which of the following is used in winter season to stay warm? Now, A is fan. We use that in the summers, right? B is a heater. Now, heater is used in winter season to stay warm. We already got our answer. That is option B. Question eighteen: Which among the following plants has the longest life span? Coriander, wheat, jasmine, or banyan? Now. generally trees are the one that have the longest life span trees are big tall and strong plants they live for many years and out of these four which one is tree it is option d banyan okay banyan is a tree and hence it will have the longest life span question 19 we get dash fiber from the animal shown here so do you know the animal shown here the animal shown in the given figure is a yak and animals like yak sheep etc give us woolen fibers which are used to make warm woolen clothes so option a woolen is the right answer because that is uh, something which we get from yak question 20 select the incorrect statement option a. 
there are about 300 muscles in our body now this itself is incorrect because there are about 600 muscles in our body b facial expressions are controlled by muscle movements that is absolutely correct c heart does not have any muscles now this is absolutely incorrect because heart is a muscular organ it has muscles which beats continuously d is both a and c and our right option is option d because both a and c are incorrect statements question 21 vehicles with which have engine run on fuel like petrol diesel cng or all of these now here the right answer should be option d all of these engines of different vehicles are designed in a different way and they use different type of fuels petrol diesel cng they all are fuels okay question 22 which among the following is the same type of how as the one shown in the given picture bungalow tent carva or houseboat now here let's look at the picture picture is of a multi-storied building which contains different flats they are also called a pakka house so out of these four only bungalow is a pakka house tent carva and houseboat they are temporary houses so option a bungalow is the right answer question 23 unscramble the given letters to find out the name of the fiber obtained from an insect so let's unscramble a will get linen b will get cotton c will get wool and d will get silk now cotton linen and linen are obtained from their plants wool is obtained from animal like sheep or yak etc whereas silk is obtained from the cocoon of an insect called silk worm so our right option is option d question 24 strike out every alternate letter starting from the first one and select the option that gives the name of a festival which is also called the festival of lights so do you know which festival we call as a festival of lights it's diwali now let's do one thing from a to d option we'll first do the exercise of striking out every alternate letter starting from the first one so let's do that with a and here we go what do we get it's a wedding so it's not diwali what do we get here it is Besaki. let's see see what do we get here it's diwali so we already got our option option c is the right answer because d gives us holy so out of a b c d c is diwali question 25 in case of cuts and wounds you should not tie a bandage over it never take any first aid clean the wound with a piece of cotton dipped in an antiseptic liquid or never put a bandage around it the right answer here should be option c in case of cuts and wounds first aid should be given to the injured person immediately first of all we should clean the wound with a piece of cotton dipped in an antiseptic liquid then tie a bandage or put a bandit over it okay so option c is the right answer or right action which we should perform question 26 which of the given statements is not correct for water water helps to digest our food correct water helps to keep our body cool correct water helps to flush out waste from our body correct or none of these so none of these is the right answer because all the above three are correct question 27 which of the following can be used by Raisha to go from Delhi to Mumbai is it bicycle or auto or train or scooty so from Delhi to Mumbai it's a very long distance and the right mean of transport should be option C train question 28 select the odd one out on the basis of types of means of communication landline phone letter postcard or television which one is odd man out so landline phone letter and postcard are means of personal communication while television is a means of mass communication so that is odd man out option d is the right answer question 29 when a sick person coughs or sneezes he she releases dash into the air which can make other people sick so what do they release they release germs option d is the right answer 
germs are infectious agents that are released in the form of droplets into the air when a sick person sneezes or coughs when a healthy person comes in contact with these droplets he she can fall ill let's move to question 30 select the correct match from the following so we have to find the correct one a valley valley it is written small low mountain which is incorrect valley is a low land between hills okay and hill is a small low mountain b pond is it a still water this is correct we got our correct match b but let's see other options also c plateau is it land surrounded by water on all side that is wrong because it is a high land that's flat on the top and land surrounded by water on all side is called an island d ocean is it fresh water that's incorrect because ocean is the largest salt water body on earth whereas fresh water is river so option b is the correct match pond is a still water moving to the next section that is achiever section it holds double marks for each question question 31 refer to the given diagram and select the option that correctly identifies x y and z okay let's see what is x x is exclusively oil yielding plant so here out of a b c d it can be either coconut or mustard because these both are oil yielding plant so let's keep both the options in mind z is wood yielding plant so let's see which one would be wood yielding plant is it banyan mango sesam or tuta and it would be sesam now let's look at why why is both okay it is oil yielding also and wood yielding plant also it is both which one is that is it mustard jasmine neem or people the right answer here is neem so we got our option x should be mustard that is oil yielding plant y should be neem that is both oil yielding also and wood yielding plant also and z is shisham which is wood yielding plant direction question 32 and 33 refer to the given word grid and answer the following questions so first we'll see the questions and check out all the options and then we are going to find that inside the word grid question 32 which of the following can you find in the given word grid a internal organ that forms the urine do you know about it it is kidney name of the framework of bones skeleton bony structure that protects the lungs that is rib cage and sense organ that helps us to feel that is skin now let's find out of these four which one we can find inside the word grid moving from left to right i did not get anything moving from top to bottom i got something that is rib cage so option c is the right answer because we could find that inside the word grid moving to question 33 select the name of a game that cannot be found in the given word grid so first let's understand which games are these a two player indoor game that is played on a board with 64 black and white squares that is chess my dear a multiplayer outdoor game played between two teams with a ball and wooden sticks curved at the striking end and that could be hockey a two or four player indoor game played on a table with a ball and small rackets and that's going to be table tennis d is a multiplayer game played with a rope what could it be tug of war now let's find which one we cannot find in the given word grid let's go from left to right and see my dear i got table tennis so oh, c is there i got hockey then i already got b i got chess also so a is also there so which one is left it is option d we could not find tug of war in the word grid so our right answer is option d Question thirty four. Refer to the given classification chart and select the correct option about P, Q, R, N, S. So P is a herbivore, Q is a carnivore, R is an omnivore, and S is a scavenger. So let's see all the options over here. Okay. So P can be adult frog. No. 
Frog is not herbivore. R can be hawk because they are carnivores. Okay, so this these both are not correct because P and R uh, mentioned in the option A that is frog and hawk that cannot be correct. Reason behind frog and hawk they both are carnivores. Okay, they both are in the category of Q. Let's see the option B. Q can be bear and S can be king for sure. So here Q cannot be bear because bear is an omnivore, whereas the classification of Q is carnivores. And moving to the next one, S cannot be kingfisher as kingfisher is carnivore, whereas the classification of S is scavenger. Moving to the option C, R can be sparrow. That's correct because sparrow is omnivores. And S can be vulture. Absolutely correct because vulture is a scavenger. So we already got our right option. Option C is the right one. R sparrow is omnivorous. S vulture is scavenger. Question 35. Match column 1 and 2 and select the correct option. So let's match. Talcum powder is talc. Kitchen counter can be made with granite. Lotus temple from marble, red four from sandstone. So A matches four, B matches one, C matches two and D matches three. Right option is option A. And with this we have successfully solved class two NSO that is Science Olympiad 2022 set B question paper. If you enjoyed solving this paper with us, do like the video and subscribe to the channel Kids Funzy Laugh and Learn. Share with your friends and family as well. Stay tuned because there are already so many Olympiad solved papers on our channel and we'll be uploading many more. Happy learning!